The build option in the PT200M indicator is much like a function setting option. The build option is located in the setup menu of the indicator. To get to this, press and hold the power and function keys. The full setup menu should be accessed. Build is the first option in this menu. Press OK or F to select. Using the tear key to navigate, we have the options DP, which stands for Decimal Point Position, Cap, which stands for Maximum Capacity Value, Res, which is the resolution, the step number that the indicator counts by, Units, is the units that you wish to measure the weight in, the option of high resolution or not, and cable, depending if you are using a 4 or 6 wire mode. For example, if we wanted the indicator to meet a certain set of requirements, such as these, we would need to work through the build menu and define each parameter to get us a maximum capacity of 230 kgs to two decimal places with a resolution of 0.05. The first parameter we set is the decimal place depending on the amount of resolution needed. For this example, two decimal places have been specified. Select OK to enter the option. Then use the edit button to scroll through the options and the F, OK, the F or OK button to select. The second parameter in the menu is max capacity. Press OK to open, use the SELECT key to change the position and the EDIT key to change the digit. Once correct, press OK. The next parameter is resolution. This is the step number that the indicator counts by in the lowest digit of the value. So for our example, we want to count in steps of 5. Using edit to scroll and OK to select, find and accept 5 in the menu. The last three options in the build menu involve much the same process. Once complete, press and hold the power and F key to return to normal weighing mode. The indicator is now set up and ready for calibration.